Okay. Hi, my name is Tally. I'm a sophomore from North Platte High School. <laughs> Sorry, I'm gonna breathe real quick. <laughs> okay, and this is the bouquet of pink peonies laid next to a grave. What would you do if I died? Such a heavy question to ask, such a heavy question to answer. I think of this when times are at their lowest. Get up out of this bed and walk two steps to my death. Take the pills from the top of my dresser and empty what is left from my orange prescription bottle. My eyes glaze the label. The ones I love deserve an explanation for this. Ink stains the paper with words explaining to anyone willing to read that my mind has been balanced. That they didn't tip the scale, they were what I had lived for. And I hope they will continue to live for me. <laughs> I look back to my pink pills waiting with each devilish grin. I give in to the sin they are pulling me towards one by one place. Each last goodbye into my mouth. I say a prayer for an exception to be made. That I could slip through the gaze of a so heavenly place. My heart making up for what I had done. I take a drink of water and feel the cold flow of poison so that down my throat. I close my eyes to the sweet sound of silence that has swallowed my bedroom. A whisper breaks from my mouth. I'm sorry. My eyelids grow heavy and I slowly fall back into the end of existence. Is this the feeling of regret or joy that I'm no longer a weight but now a burden or is that worse? <laughs> Sorry. Why can't there be a happy meeting between life and death? If there was, I would go and stay as long as I may before possibly returning to either side a simple turn right or left. News spread quickly through the cracks of this small town. So are haunting the slow-moving sidewalks person up into the clouds and hope that the angels would catch them. But fate has already been decided by the hands of the dead. When my letter reaches your front door, your eyes desperate for a happy ending, but instead of resolution. And you'll hate me. Hate me for what I had did and what I had done. The love inside you will go bitter because you don't know why. And you can't even come ask me, I'm gone. But tell me how. How I'm not supposed to feel... I'm not supposed to feel alone in a world full of passing people. I'm supposed to feel anything, keep this shattered heart beating. I'm supposed to feel anything with this medicine pumping through my veins. They're trying to fix me. It's not working. But I can't just leave. I can't just give up. Not anymore. So I slowly slip each pink pill back into their orange prescription bottle, put away my paper and my pen, lay my head to rest, entering an encasement of dreams. I decide to sleep another night. I decide to wake up again.